Hey guys, oh. Sparks here. We're just going to go on to New Dawn and we can't join multiplayer yet because it says new game. Okay, select body type. Well, that's a girl and that's a guy, right? So, yeah, I'm a guy. Okay, what? Well, well, um, explorer. I'm mostly interested in the story and exploring the open world. I know what I'm doing and I want to challenge and well why isn't this just a normal mode? Why does it have to be tough and hard ass? Explorer. I don't want to be explorer because that means probably one shot kills everything. No, I did the first one. You did? Mm -hmm. Um well I'm gonna pick the middle what? one because I think because that's normal one, difficulty. Just remember the first one says open world whereas the second one doesn't. Uh. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right. But I Just, thought this would yeah. be difficulty, not... Yeah, I don't know. I think that's difficulty. I don't think that's... I think that mostly interested in the story and exploring the open world means that enemies aren't going to be tough at all. Like, they're not going to be fun at all. They're just going to go down in one hit and... Yeah, I'm going to go pick the middle one. We'll see what happens. Oh. I, I don't know why they don't have normal. I think tough is normal. They're just retarded in the way that they say it. Okay, the house blew up. The day I was born was the day the world collapsed. Oh, yep, so here's the Far Cry 5 story. Up above, there was nothing but ash, cold, and death. Uh, so it's a continuation of a Far Cry 5 which is the one thing I'm very really upset about because that's mean to make multiple games of one in one story like if it's a sequel like I don't know I feel like a game should be one in its whole Captain Captain you're alive Jesus uh... heading this way Get up, Captain! Come on, get up! What's the fucking highwaymen? They're gonna kill us! Get up, Captain, get up! Oh, the game's very oh, quiet Christ. in my headphones. Like Make sure where you start, you go Rush, back into the room you Captain. came out of. No, we have no time, we gotta go! Barnes, we are not leaving the Captain behind. 
I think you gotta finish the first act to get into the co-op mode. We need to stick together. Understood? Yep, I'm trying. Yeah. Your time to shine. We need to get armed, we need to get our people, and we need you to find our way out of here. I know, yeah, easier said than done. One step at a time, Barnes. You lead, we'll follow. Okay. Crawling from the wreckage. Wreckage. I thought it was dead. Oh! Find the armory wagon. You're up. Save as many people as you can. This way. Why? Stick with the captain. We should cut our losses and run. We'll be fine. No. More to be safe. Deluxe packed on lot. Visit the garage and workbench. Character. Blah blah blah. Deputy outfit unlocked. You can change to your outfit in the character menu. Was there something I meant to pick up? Loot? Oh, I nearly yeah. missed some loot. Make sure you go back into the room you came out of. Yep, done. Yep. Oh, there's stuff on that train, but... Okay, cool. So what do we do? We... Just slowly go through and just search. Oh, How yeah. can I escort someone? I don't even have a weapon. I know, right? Well, you have F. You can F them to death. <laughs> that sounds very ironic. I can F them to death, alright. <laughs> Wow, that music. But now if you'll hear that or not. There's a sandstorm coming. We're in big trouble if we get caught in that. We need to get Yeah, well I've got streamer mode on. Let's see if it actually works. I have a funny feeling it won't. Ubisoft aren't very good at their development. Like okay. the game's good, but they're not very good at stuff like that. Well, when you go out of the train engine, there'll be this music that starts up wrapping up. I found someone to revive. Yeah, and a train wreckage. Oh, really? Yeah, not at this very start. It's kind of like after they do the whole speaker thing and say, we're coming for you. Wow. I can't even... I'm punching this guy, but he just, like, so much stronger. I think he's dead. Can't tell. Where's your weapon? You had a gun and go. Now a second to go, now you don't. What? Yeah, that's, that's what happened to me when I picked up this shield. I lost my, my gun. Oh, suddenly I have a knife. Okay, now I've got a gun. Take. I got doubts about the mission. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, I've rescued a couple of people. Oh, it actually has a damage meter come up now when you shoot them. It tells you how much damage they're doing. It said revive that person, but they didn't actually revive. Oh, escape. But there's a place to search here. 
Oh, whoops, I nearly punched the guy. Use shield? Oh, yeah, I don't want to use the shield. I did. Oh. I threw it at one of the enemies and it went dong. And knocked him down dead. In one hit. Which you can throw it. <laughs> we need to retreat. Oh, it is. I should probably get a shield just to dong them on the head. Yeah, you can throw it at them. <laughs> Oh wow, it gets really like crowded quick. You do really have to leave everybody. Oh, that sucks. I just revived a bunch of people and they all died. <laughs> yeah, as soon as it says escape, just escape. Don't stay there because all your people will get killed. Very annoying. The weapons they give you are garbage compared to the enemies you're fighting. Yeah, it's meant to be overpowered. That's okay. I think these are the bosses. Just shoot them now. Game over. You win. <laughs> They've got guns. Why don't we just shoot them now and finish the game early? The world's got too many fucking problems. And we're looking for people to help solve problems. Uh, our problems. If you're a problem solver. How are we supposed to read all that? Food, well, we're being clothes, shot at. Guns. <laughs> Anything you need. <laughs> Even health insurance. <laughs> <laughs> but if you make problems, well, Pops taught us what to do with problem makers. Problem makers need to be solved. Mm -hmm. Old man solved a shit ton of problems in his day. Yeah. Hell yeah. So. Oh, there's a bit of gun here. Oh. Are you all. Wow, it's like a. A problem maker. I don't know what it is. We solve problems. Machine gun I've got or something like that. We can give you fresh water, build shelters. We can get you anything you need. Barnes, shut up. You can build all that? Well, I'm not me. But Rush here. Well, then you are going to be our number one problem solver. Go fuck yourself. Oh boy. Oh. Okay. <laughs> uh. Well, they killed the nice guy that was being friendly to them. That's not very nice. Before you drowned, but 
near as I can tell, I think we're the only ones who got away. Come on. Okay. We have to be careful. The twins, they took off with Rush, but a lot of the highwaymen, they stuck around. Okay, we, we have to get back to Hope County. My mom, my mom, she'll know what to do. Come on. Okay. Just Q to go your weapon wheel. Come on. We just need to follow the river to get to Hope County. Oh, what happened to my gun? Oh, they took away my gun. I can't believe what happened. Survival guide. Find hope. Oh, great. The per the. They must have seen the train. Come. Don't tell me, because <laughs> hope was the name of Faith before she got renamed Faith. <laughs> Those fucking twins, Nikki and Lou. Okay, so we're gonna track this. First time I saw. We have a map. No map. Oh, no map in this game. Into our house. There it should be. It says M for map. Even just takes me to the tab menu. Maybe we have to pick one up. So it must be like a world apocalypse. Like it must have been nukes all over the world or something because the way they're talking, it's as if the whole world is like this. the mine Rush was supposed to be the it's very pretty though I have to say he just pushed us off so why didn't they all just jump in I know right I'm sorry. hey there's a gun underwater there's that workbench I told you about Rush said you were resourceful so let's build something Oh, you got crafting in this game? Oh, there's a workbench. I didn't know they had crafting. Awesome. People see this game is really fun, though. Build makeshift weapons and refill ammo. Ah. Yeah, we need more resources. We're gonna have to poke around and scare some up. You have to build your own weapons. You can't just pick them up. Okay. Oh, you'll like this game, I think, because you could have find all your stuff to build better weapons. You're gonna love this. Hey, remember to look up high too. Yep, I think you're gonna love this game. Wow. Like I said, it's real pretty. I'll go ahead and break the lock. Oh, that's where all my resources are, no doubt. You can find useful things almost anywhere. Where did I find that locked place? Where are you, Lockie? Oh, up there. Sometimes you have to break something. No, that's you. I found a lock place, but I can't find it again. Um God, I must be blind. Thought it was right here somewhere.
Maybe it's on the ground floor. The rats have no fur. Are them. they rats? Yeah. I want to see what you can fight together. Yo. Yep, they look like rats. They look like rats? Yeah, yeah they... well the deer were different as well. The deer didn't like have fur. Albino albinos or whatever they are. Or something. I don't know. I saw a lock room with a with a key now i cannot find it okay let me just retrack my steps because man i might see be like just walking right past it so i jumped up here i walked through here and then i walked up here and then there was a lock but i'm not here now Gone. Oh, there's a place over there. over here and out here oh I like this idea of it anyway let's see if it actually pulls through as a good like crafting game oh here it is oh that's weird Oh, it's the smoke. Saw blades. There we go, I found it. Okay, cool. Makeshift weapon. Craft. Yeah, I guess it's number two. Cool, there we go. We got our first weapon. Holy shit, is that some kind of saw launcher? That's amazing. Man, those highwaymen are in for it now. Now we're ready to attack the bridge. Okay, you make your first weapon, then you can attack the bridge. What about the mine? What did it have in it? Yes, you told me to go there, but where? What? Oh, down there. There's a sawmill next to the mine. <laughs> I think it's a sawmill. Wow! What is the weapon? That was awesome! <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, that's a new type of weapon. That's pretty cool. Oh yeah.
Wow, this weapon's pretty neat. I don't know whether to stop the dog or not because it's killing all my enemies. You only have one weapon in the bench, or is there a way to look at others? No, it's only one weapon. It's pretty good though. I don't think you'll have any problem with that weapon, that's for sure. The weapon is extremely good. I just don't know why I can't pick up multiple weapons. I guess you have to unlock the perk or something. I would like the shotgun that I just found, but I've got this awesome weapon which is way better than a shotgun. The makeshift weapon you get given at the start is pretty OP. It's a um, homing, homing weapon. So if you shoot one enemy and there's another enemy nearby, it kills them too. So the makeshift weapon you make is extremely good. Do my usual thing of search everywhere. Yeah, nothing here. <clears throat> A few hours later. Should be out of the tutorial soon and then we can um, go into co-op mode. Come on, we're almost there. Oh, Hope County. Well, what's left of Hope County after Far Cry 5, right? Home. I hope Mom is okay. isn't doing any good. Look, Rush was supposed to help us build someplace safe. Now, it's up to us. There are brave people here scattered around. We just have to find them. Bring everyone together. Show them we can stand up to the highwaymen. Mom, it's not gonna be easy. I know. But it's our only choice.
Oh. Working my ass off here, but it feels worth it. Am I out of tutorial yet? So this is it. Home. Mom's right. The two of us can work together to build this place mm -hmm. back up. Any time you need a hand, give me a call. I'll come fight by your side, Cap. You don't mind if I call you Cap, right? Captain of security just sounds, well, a little formal. Why don't you just use my name? <laughs> Why call me Cap? Before we get started, there's some stuff over there. You should I have a name. Talk to Mom. She'll give you the rundown on what we can do for prosperity. Whatever else happens, I'm glad Carmina made it back. I just hope that one day, Nick, Carmina, and I can fly the skies as a family again. Oh, cool. You get to choose your custom. Cool yeah, he looks like a real bushy guy. I'm sad I don't have any colorful clothes though. Oh, but depressing. Confirm. Uh -huh. Okay. What's this note? This is what's left of Eden's Gate, and what Joseph grew from it once. He left his bunker. Ah, uh, yeah, Joseph. I've completely rejected everything to do with the modern world before the collapse. Electricity, engines, generators, guns, it's all gone. After the collapse, Joseph gathered all his people and built a new compound up north. For some better part of the decade, we left each other alone while we rebuilt now they now they only leave their compound at night to do to attack the highwaymen also oh, joseph's actually a, a good guy in this <laughs> oh my god if i didn't know any better i'd swear those masks ifers are the or friggers are the are afraid of Joseph's people. Okay, so Joseph is not a bad guy technically. He's fighting the highwaymen. Honestly, didn't think Carmina would come back, let alone with help. We gotta watch out for each other now more than ever. So much food for thought, it's like a feast. Okay. Oh, what's this property? What? Did I just see property? What's property? I've got some things to tell you. A lot of us around here we're, we're preppers. So despite the cluster, the Eden's Gate 
we managed to scrape through the nuclear winter in recent years some new people came to hope county some were pushed south from the cold north others from the famine and disease out east at first we all sort of kept to ourselves but gradually a sense of community has was reborn we started accomplishing more once we were able to start trusting each other again until the highway men showed up the worst had we had to deal with with the animals now we risk losing everything we've worked so hard for working my ass off here but my name is kim i guess you could say i run things around here oh hold on there's more let's get to work yeah so my name is kim i guess you could say i run things around here i know you've already been through a lot captain but the truth is we need all the help we can get and at the moment you're it we thought your people on that train were going to give us an edge we were all going to work together to grow things make things we were going to fight back against the twins but all of that is gone now so it's up to us we've got a lot of work to do let me show you how things work around here okay find all the it's photographs if we're gonna have a fighting chance against the highwaymen, the first thing we've got to do is get this place up and running. We have several facilities to make prosperity thrive. These are the places where you can craft weapons and vehicles, cultivate plants for health, and many other things. Oh cool, so you've got a home base now. That's awesome. I like that. That's very good. Home base is this nice. This is Hope County. In order to get the most out of our facilities, we need ethanol to upgrade them. Your map shows the highwaymen outposts, where they store the ethanol they stole from us. Secure these locations to get what we need. And here's where you can find specialists. People with the expertise to really give us a fighting chance against the Oh, Grace is still alive! Grace Armstrong, from the original. Really? But without Thomas yeah, Rush, she's an old lady now. He's built up settlements before, and without his knowledge, we won't be able to take prosperity to the next level. Lately, the twins are sending a lot of prisoners to the coal mine. I'd start looking there. So, that's it. We rescue Rush, find people who can run the facilities, and bring them enough ethanol to maximize what we can craft. If you can help us, we'll do everything we can to help you. Looking good, pal. Howdy. Hello. I really hope a lot of this video isn't muted, because I can still hear, like, copyright-sounding music. But it's just turned really far down, like, very quiet. So I think the copyright protection is basically we turn down the music a lot. So I don't think it's going to work. But um, I guess I'll post this video and see. But yeah, I think um, I've got to find all the photographs in Hope County. Oh no, I think that's it. I think I'm out of the tutorial. Now it looks like I'm free to run around and do what I want. Well, that's cool. Um, so this is our home base. Now all these doors can be opened. Wow, it's beautiful. I love this place. I like it. It's cool. And to build your own crafting and stuff, like, you you search everywhere to pick up, like, materials so that you can build new weapons. Oh, yeah, and then we need to get ethanol to upgrade the facilities. I think we're going to do that fine, because we'd love to search and get everything. So this is cool. I like this. But anyway, I'm going to call the stream, uh, the recording here. And um, I hope you guys are enjoying this new game. Like, um, I know lots of people have already beaten it and put it up on YouTube and stuff. But um, this is my adventure. Like, obviously, this is the way I'm experiencing the game. And um, yeah, it looks pretty cool. I'm enjoying it so far. Like, the idea of it. Like, I'm sad that Joseph pretty much won the previous game. But um, now we're going to see his side of, like, surviving in the apocalypse that he caused. But yeah, let's um, continue this adventure and see how we go. The battle systems seem the same, so I like that. And they've done a few, like, tweaks in the game that make it better than Far Cry 5, I think. Um, 
the crafting your own weapons is cool because you're not just running around searching for new weapons you're actually get blueprints i'm guessing and build your own weapons and uh yeah but anyway i'll catch you guys in the next video thanks for watching like subscribe and i'll catch you next time bye bye